people make the mistake of saying that they can't wait to church to get saved. My friend, the church does not save you, meaning the building does not save you. What saves you is the word of God. There are a lot of people that are making the mistake I can't wait to get into the house of God. My friend, the house of God is within you. Salvation is waiting right where you are. You can give your life to Jesus Christ right now. The only thing I do is open your heart and let God in. Make a confession. If you believe that God, Jesus Christ, God has raised Jesus Christ from the dead, thou shalt be saved. With a mouth, confession is made on salvation. It's a gift. The only thing I do is receive the gift and you shall be saved. Save come from Acts 2.38. Repent and be baptized, every one of you, for the mission of sin. And you shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. Let me say it again, my friend. Peter said to them, repent and be baptized, every one of you, in the name of Jesus Christ, for the mission of your sins. And you shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. So you can be saved right now. Be glory to God. And when you get saved right now, find you a pool, find you a beach, find you a river, and get baptized. Because the baptism doesn't save you. But it's good to be obedient to the word of God. Because in glory to God in Romans, glory to God in the sixth chapter, glory to God in verse number one. Shall we continue in sin that grace may abound? God forbid. How shall we live any longer therein? Know ye not that so many of us were baptized, and the Jews Christ were baptized into his death. Therefore, we are buried with him, with him into death. That like as Christ has raised up from the dead by the glory of the Father, he so should we walk in newness of life. But if we have been planted together by the baptism of his death, we shall also be likeness of the resurrection. Know this. That our old man is crucified. When you've been baptized in the water, your old man is crucified. The body of sin might be destroyed. And henceforth, we should not serve sin. Hey, glory to God. For, for he that is dead is free from sin. For if, if, now if, the Bible says, now if we be dead with Christ, we believe that we shall also live with him. Knowing that Christ being raised from the dead, died no more. Death have no more dominion over him. For in that he died, he died of the sin once, but in that he lived, he lived unto God. So baptism doesn't save you, but you'll be obedience to the word of God. God told Peter, glory to God, he told Nicodemus that except a man be born of the water and the spirit, he shall not enter into the kingdom of God. So go to church, don't save you.